Okay, um, this is going to be my first tutorial um, for beginner map makers. Um, I'm going to start out with something simple and maybe as we go on I'll go into something more complicated. Um, so for the first tutorial I'll just show you how to make a simple one room map. I remember at one point doing me doing that. Um, hopefully, at the end of all these tutorials, um, you will get as good as me, or, you know, even better. So, first, you start by opening up under lid. Okay. Just save this file as whatever you want to call it, but be sure to save it later because as we go on, we'll add more to this so we'll make it a full map. Hopefully, this won't turn out too bad. Hopefully, you beginners don't have a computer this slow as mine, so it's probably opened up by now. Okay, there we go. First, right click this little cube right here. Now, there's three slots that you are to edit. First one is height, how tall your room will be, the width, how wide the room will be, and the breadth, how the other whatever. So, set your width to 900 and the breadth to 900 then click build down a small red square should pop up right here so now you want to add textures to it so you can walk on it uh, Josh textures has some very good textures on it so first go to program files postal to STP and scroll down to textures and open. Now there should be a whole lot of textures. Now select Josh textures and open. Okay, let's give it a nice wall texture. So there's brick, carpet, ceilings, concrete. Let's give it a nice stucco. And let's go with this. And just click subtract. And now the room should look like this. Now, usually rooms will look better if you align them together. First, right click all four sides. Click alignment. And click planner walls. Now they should all be aligned. Now you want to give your floor a nice texture. Let's give it a nice wood texture. So click wood and you'll have several textures. Let's go to this. Now if you'd like to align it with other rooms that we'll lay build later on, just click planner floor. Okay, let's give the ceiling a nice texture as well. Now Quick ceilings. Uh, let's try this acoustic tile. And to align ceilings, click planner floors. Now, never align floors with planner walls, or it will look like this. Okay. Now, add a light in the middle of the room. Just put right click and click add light here. Now, you want to put it in the center of the room. Just click top right here, and then move it to the middle right here. Now you want to put it in the middle, so click front or side. Click the, the light bulb, it should be highlighted green, and move it to the dot in the center. Now, you want to illuminate the textures. Click build all. 
So now your room should look like this. Never attempt to open up your map what before building all, or you'll just explode. Now, let's put player start. If you don't put a player start in your map, the game will crash. So right click and click add player start here. Now your player start will be right here, the little controller. Well, let's say that you want your player to be in another area of the room. So now just click it and click control and drag it wherever you like. Or you can always click shift control, I mean shift click and the camera will move with it. So now you know where it will go. So let's say that you want it to face another side of the wall. So now what you do is you control right click and you can always turn it like that. So now click save and if you always want to make a custom map always click always type CUS first. So let's name this test and click save. It should be saved to your map directory. Now let's open it up on postal 2. Also, if you would like to make a map for regular Postal 2 and not AWP, you can always just save it to your SCP directory. I can show you how to do that in the next tutorial. Okay. Hopefully this is recording. All right. To open up a custom map, just click options and then click custom map. Now you want to find your map. If you remember, we named it CUS Test Map. So, it is out. So, let's click Load. And now the game's loading. If you did what I said, your room should look like this. Doesn't look like much, right? Well, it should look like this. As we go on later, it will be more detailed and hopefully it will be a full map. So, um, no. So, if you have any questions, just message me or just post a comment on this video. Thanks.